Hello and welcome back to another Hot Dogs, Horseshoes and Hand Grenades. I'm CC Cypher and today, well we're not starting with Return of the Rock Wieners. We may get onto that in a bit, but there's been an update, Update 79, which is a few bug fixes, as well as um, maybe a mild little uh, revolver spam from the developer. But anywho, yes. So... First things first, uh, one feature that I really, really like is, well, we have all these guns, and I'm not perfect in my knowledge of my guns. Most guns I'll go, for example, uh, that's part of the AK pattern. That's part of whatever pattern. The idea is I might be able to pick up specific guns. For example, I truly know that this is a Webley Mark VI, but I've been that for being British. Anywho. So now, let's say, I don't know. I forgot the name of this one. That's the last one I spawned, but I forgot its name. Hmm. Oh, look. It's the Schofield Model 3. This was the last gun added in the previous update. We'll explain why that's there anyway. So, yeah. This has been reworked. One, it tells you what item you're holding. So, for example, this is a cartridge for the 600 million bolt high explosive. Well, HE. I'm presuming high explosives. So, yeah. This... And the face looks a lot cleaner, and we've got clean-up stuff. And they've got confirmation options for all of that stuff, which is good. And you reset it by doing that. Anywho, well, let's get started with the guns. This is a selection of new guns. Two of them are sci-fi. Some of them are a remake of old guns that have been removed and given a proper model and functioning and all that. But anywho, uh, we'll start from the top in alphabetical order. So here we have... The B600. That's a beefy gun. And we have a selection of ammo here. So, we've got... Let's start from the bottom. We've got jacketed hollow points. So, we'll spawn... Spawn a bunch of these. So, it's a six-shooter. Uh, double action. So, let's spawn some sausages. So, this is jacketed hollow point. So, it's good versus... Flesh. Not so good first armor. As you can see, it uh, ricocheted. Not ricocheted, um, it wasn't lethal. But put it in his chest, blows him to bits. Yeah, it's a double action revolver. With some hell of a size rounds. I guess this is him one upping the um, 500 Magnum. And, of course, you've got to make it better. So, we've got some AP rounds here as well. As well. Um, they are chambered in... Well, that one's AP. This is something else. They are not chambered. They are just armor-piercing. So, AP. The others were jacketed hollow point. So, these ones will actually punch your armor. If we see... It'll start bleeding. Not as effective versus non-armored targets. And could possibly overpen. But you can shoot through walls. Now, the truly fun round is this one. This is basically. Well, you saw its name before, High Explosive, but that's not its true name. It's. That's its programming name. Its actual name is Sticky Explosive. So. Yeah. It's a needle spine. Apparently this is was inspired by the um, medic needle gun that he added in the Mute Force update. Also apparently occasionally they bounce and don't stick. Which sounds fun. Who wants an explosive needle come flying back at you? Who doesn't want that? Anywho, uh, let's tie that up. So that's the B600. Next off, we have the Bull 454. Chambered in. And let's see what it's chambered in. 454. Four. I've currently picked up the trace around. So, let's see what it is. I'm pretty sure this is a double action. Yep, double action revolver. Uh, let's spawn a few sausages. Uh. Okay, you two have your fun. One more shot. 
It's a nice double action revolver. And let's just see, can I do fan the hammer? Can you do it on this one? Oh no, that's only single action. Why am I trying to do it on double, double action revolvers? Uh, ignore me being special. Anywho, yeah. A nice revolver. To be honest, a lot of them are going to be similar. Now, this is a conversion gun, if I remember, and this is a single action. Yes, it's a C1851 conversion, which is apparently like this hodgepodge between two versions of the gun that are very similar. I don't know if they truly exist, but yeah. Uh, it's a nightmare to reload, as you can see. That's the last shot. Close it. And I'll shoot because it's, well, single action. So I have to cock it before we shoot. Darn it. That should be all bullets. And then we can... Die. Two, three, four, five. They should all be loaded. I might have made a mistake. So let's see if I can fan the hammer. I forgot how you do this. Yes, yeah, so you hold. Right, so how you fan the hammer if you don't know how to do it? Let's. Empty the gun, as you can see, very fun. I was trying to do the smart way where you empty, load, empty, load, empty, load. I'm not good. So, hold your trigger on this one. Uh, well, cock it first, hold the trigger on this one. Hold, then hold your trigger on here. And every time you swipe it past, and fan the hammer. Yeah. I always forget to find the hammer with those, but anywho, generally, because it's probably not a good idea. So, next gun, I believe it's another single action revolver. This is the FA 83. Yeah. Get rid of you. Wrong button. So, yeah, also to eject the mag, uh, spent shells, sorry. Whilst it's open, you just pull the trigger. If you forgot how these things work. So. Let's spawn some sausages. Let's see how uh, clean all sausages. Spawn some sausages. Let's see how good it is. Wrong one. Don't forget to cock the hammer. Yeah, five shots is not a lot. But anywho, yes. There's another gun. It's probably going to be a lot of this for this time. So this is the Hawk 357. It's another single action revolver. Chambered in. Three five. Of course, three five seven. It's Ugh, brain. Anywho, that's a six shot. So three five five. Yeah, that's a six shot. So you can also cock it by literally just pulling on the hammer like so. So. Got the wrong part of the controller. That should be all the shots. Yeah. Another revolver. Now this one, this is an interesting one. This is the lady's companion. Uh, that That's not the gun that I'm holding. That's not an FA-83. I can assure you that's not an FA-83. Uh, that is a lady's companion. Wherever it is. It's back left. There. It's a lady's companion. Interesting bug. Anywho, so this is another single action revolver. As you can tell. And, well, this one is currently... It's, I don't believe you put the right ammo in. I believe it's currently got 22 long rifle. It's apparently around very similar to this. So, you know button I 
This thing's gonna, um... This might be lethal. Now let's see if I can hit any of them all the way over there. With no foresight or anything. Well, no sight. Missed. Hey, I actually hit. Darn it. Dang it. It's not really on the lethal side, but I won't lie. It's a um, interesting gun. Anywho, so next one is another homemade sci-fi gun by him. It's a break action. Uh, very dingy thing. Also, this is a revolver that can, uh, where are we? Attachments. It can take attachments. So, for example, let's slap on, I don't know, a beefy suppressor. So, yeah. And this one, by default, comes with that. And I believe it's um, double action, if I remember correctly. And because it's got a speed loader, it's nice and easy to reload. So yeah, I do like um, guns with a speed loader. And let's have a listen to what it sounds like without the suppressor. Mm. Decent sound. And it is a 22 Winchester mag. I think, I think that's Winchester. If I remember correctly. So we should have a bunch of uh, one, two, three Smith and Westons of different uh, styles, and they should all be chambered in the same round, so I didn't need to spawn ammo for each one of them. So this is the Smith and Weston nine, no oh, twenty-nine. Uh, let's clean up some sausages. Double action as always. Now uh, you can always cock, pre-cock the hammer, so you're on a her trigger. So I. Burly have to touch it instead of having to go. It's just lightest touch. Also, I missed. So yeah, a good old speed loading revolver. And everyone loves a good revolver. Uh, so next we've got the Super Western Six Two Nine and the Smith and Western Stealth. It's basically a colour change, uh, except for different sized barrels as well. So this one has a bigger barrel than the... Uh, where did I drop you? I forgot where I dropped it. Then the 29. It's a longer barrel, so, you know, more fun. Anywho, um, this gun. Now, this is apparently a very interesting gun. So this is... Unica 6. I would called 6 because it's a 6 shooter, but don't quote me on that. Chambered in 357. So, this gun. Oops, I shouldn't have done that. Is a double action revolver, but more than that as well. So, there's the hammer cocked. And we'll shoot. And you'll notice the, the, the hammer's cocked again. See? I'll just shoot through all the bullets. There's the hammer uncocked. And to prove that it's double action, when I go get the right uh, ammo. Ammo, 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 ammo. Uh, revolvers, revolvers, Unica, 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 Unica. Prove that it's double action. Shoots. Apparently, this is a gas-assisted gun. I forgot what the proper name is it, but basically, the gas is cycled off to re reset the hammer, like they do in automatic rifles and semi-automatics. So effectively, it's a, it's a semi-automatic. That also support double action. And you can also fire it like a single action because, you know, Double action revolvers can do that. Anywho, a few more on 
the updates. What was the change to the Webley? Well, you may have noticed it. It's this thing. It's a speed loader. Possibly one of the first speed loaders ever created. Oh, I know. Anywho, yes. Double action. Revolver. Or a break action shot. Well, it's not technically break action. It's break action. I always get that name wrong. That bit. Because it's not technically break action because that doesn't action the gun, but... You know, I'm a terrible human and should really look up the names, but yeah. Nice. Clean. Revolver. And now you don't have to do the um, load it anti-clockwise. Yes, it's clockwise. So normally if you had single load on this, you'd go dink, 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 dink. So, in case you were halfway through and you're like, dink, dink, enemy, you have however many shots you've loaded instead of having to cycle round. But anywho, yes. Now, as for the Schofield Model 3, well, for some reason, he accidentally implemented this as a double-action revolver. When actually, it's a single action. And unfortunately, uh, this one can't be, um, found the hammers. Unfortunately, he hasn't implemented that yet. He did mention that. And he'll probably add that later. So, yeah. Don't shoot. Got the cock it. Anywho, yeah. Uh. Oh, you can't break the action whilst it's cocked. But you can cock it whilst it's broken. Oh, well. Let's see how long we've been going for and if there's time for anything else. 17 minutes already? Ooh, don't see myself being able to do anything. Let's have a look at this cleanup. So, clean up all empty mags. That should get rid of these speed loaders, but not get rid of those. So, that one should stay, that one should disappear. I don't know. Okay, maybe not. I don't have any mags around. And clean up all guns and melee. Excellent. And then we'll clean up all sausages. And voila! She's beautiful. She's clean. Oh, also, um, all the banger items are now in the recipe thing. Uh, misc. Crafting. We can have fun with bangers here. They apparently were all scattered on the table. So, yeah. I do like the bangers. <laughs> it's a fun little addition. Apparently you put guns in them as well. I can't remember. Was it guns or was it ammo? I've only ever done it with the uh, flower petal stuff, the herbs, so apparently this should create a banger. What is it? More gun. Nice 30 second banger. Just sit it on there. Oh, watch it go off. Because why not? It's fun. Thirty seconds was probably a bit too long, but you know. Eh. That was um. Cluster. Oh, oh yes, it didn't delete the suppressor. So the suppressors don't get deleted with the gun's destruction. Interesting. Very interesting. Anywho, yes. Um, I don't think there's anything else to show. Let me just have a quick look at the update notes. I don't think there's anything else. Uh. Oh yes, 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 yes. In, actually, do you know what? We'll go look at that scene. We'll go to the Return of the Rock Reunion. It's a little thing we can show off because he has actually added it. So, you, you probably all remember the puke buckets. 
and how they're around everywhere for puking up the meat cores. Give me a second. Once it loads in, go on, man. Oh, also, I should have mentioned this earlier. I'm uploading on Sundays and Wednesdays from now on instead of Saturdays because this game updates on a Friday night slash technically Saturday morning for me because of time zones. Basically, I'd like a bit more time to record and edit and try and help me stop making terrible editing mistakes and recording mistakes and all that. Because apparently, I keep doing that. Anywho, so yes, the puke bucket has been added. Yeah, so you've got that puke bucket down there. And now, uh, all the way up. Come on. Up to the top. Long way to the top. We have a puke bucket here that's... Is that clipping? That may or may not be clipping. And is also completely blocking all Wienerton sign. But anywho. Yes. Science can now be easily puked. <coughs> I may have technically missed. But uh, that does not matter. Anywho. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. I can English. I trust, trust, trust me. I can. Hope you enjoyed. If you did so, hit that like button. Got any comments, questions, drop them down in the comment section below. I'll answer them if possible. New channel, hit that subscribe button to stay up to date. Don't forget, you can follow me on Twitter and support me on Patreon. Links for those are down in the description. Stay well and survive out. Cheerio.